Welcome to Monday Night Mayhem on Chelsea Community Radio 104.4 FM. Luke. Yep. I'm looking at you now. Mm hmm. And you don't seem yourself. No, I don't, because, like, it was like last week, it was the Halloween games. Yeah, I didn't know whether to bring it up or to no, um, leave it, was, it alone. It was spooky. Spooky season. <laughs> Yeah, it was spooky season, and but I don't think that's the reason why you're uh, like, um, looking so sorry for yeah, yourself. Yeah, it's because, shall I say it, if you have heard on the Seashell 104.4 FM or on Spotify... That's right. I lost. <laughs> lost is... A big yeah, word. Yeah, I'm. Gl- well, look, I'm one, I'm glad that you're saying that you lost. <laughs> yeah, not going to say, I won, kind of thing, that doesn't work. <laughs> well, even more than that, I was expecting a, <laughs> maybe a false spy report was going to oh, be yeah. inserted into this conversation. Not this time, not this time. No? Straight to, I lost. <laughs> you lost, and it was a, mm, can I say? What? Look, well, because it was the Halloween games, mm. it, yeah, it was, was specifically... Um, Spooky and... <laughs> I can't even think of any other words to do well, with Halloween. Well, the questions were specifically about... To do with Halloween. Halloween. Yeah. And it mm. shows that somehow Stuart, with his... Knowledge. Knowledge, uh, beat you. He, yeah. It's like even one of the knowledge was about one that... Like the vampire kind of thing or whatever it was question. I can't remember what question it was, but if you listen back <laughs> on Spotify, you'd be able to hear what I'm saying. Yes, I imagine there was a Halloween question about vampires. That could be correct. I don't know whether that was going to give me greater detail. I thought that was going to be a mini spy report then. But... Spy report? <laughs> no. <laughs> but no, yeah. So Stuart came in mm. after already being crowned the champion. Summer of... Games champion, not yeah. champions. The champion of champions from the Summer Games. But he now came he's back into the Monday Night Mayhem, and he's still the champ. Yeah, he came the champion of champions still, and now he's the Halloween champion as well. Yeah, he's got that trophy to add to his collection, which yes. means that he might be the biggest champion of going forward. Yeah, he might be actually in terms of trophies, mm. titles. Yeah, I think he is. Actually, has he been you at the trophy cabinet? I think he <laughs> might have actually. I have to get some uh, confirmation from yes. our producers, but I think he mm. might be the most decorated champion in all yeah. of Monday Night because like history. It's like the trophy, as you said on the show, it was like a golden, spooky hand with diamonds on it. Yeah, yeah. Like none of the other shows we've had. With awards had that on it. Yeah, it was adorned oh. with diamonds. It was um, absolutely gorgeous. And if you yeah. want to have a look at it, go onto mm. our YouTube channel at Monday Night Mayhem, and you'll be able to watch the whole, whole show. The big reveal of yes. the trophy, um, the moments mm. where uh, <laughs> where I wasn't where that, l- <laughs> even when I wasn't there at the beginning. <laughs> Just yeah. Hint. Oh, yeah. That's very interesting. Yeah. There was um... the rebirth. <laughs> yeah. I was saying about that. I've totally forgotten <laughs> that because you lost last week, mm. I totally. I went back into my grave. Yeah. You. I'm out of my grave now, people, as you can hear. <laughs> I was going to say, you've still got a little bit of redness, a little bit of bruising yeah. still. Still here. <laughs> but mainly, most of it is healed. Mm. Yeah, it's healed now. It's healed. It's healed. Okay. Well, look. So I think, well, look, the listeners, they can comment, they can call in, yep. see whether they've got any commentary mm. on your performance last week. <laughs> of the coming back from the dead and going to the dead. <laughs> but let's try and let's try and give you a week off mm. where you don't have to think about... The Halloween games. The Halloween games, the yes. champion of champions, all the trophies. And all that lost. kind of thing. Let's try and have a, uh, a yeah. show. Mm. Where let's have an upbeat show oh yeah let's okay let's try that right. <laughs> i don't know how to say it but there you go <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, we can go for an upbeat show yeah i'm not too sure now we have had some comments mm-hmm. yep some messages have come into the studio yes they have haven't they 
and um, about your performance. Yep. What I I can't remember what I said, but because <laughs> uh, you haven't shown me. <laughs> a few people have revoked their Team Luke memberships. Ah, oh, damn it. Um, <laughs> but to, have they gone to Team Bias yet? <laughs> uh, look, I, I'm not even winning these guys at the moment. They what? seem to be um, actually Team Stewart. <laughs> team Stewart, which what? could be a problem. There's a new team on the on the Monday Night Mayhem show. Look, it's there's Team Stuart now. I look, there is a force to be reckoned with. Yeah. Um, that unfortunately mm. we opened up the summer games this year. <laughs> yes, we did to everyone. To all competitors. Yeah. And Stuart won it. He showed up and he, he proved that he got to the championship just like that. Yeah. He um, mm. pretty much uh, destroyed yeah. you and straight um... away. <laughs> <laughs> I thought as the other competitor, if I can say this from the summer games, Michael. Oh yeah, we did have. Like, I thought he would beat me, as he did. One of our listeners. Yeah, and, like, he beat me, but he didn't get into the final. Yeah, he wasn't quite good enough to get to the top mm. of the uh, leaderboard to yes. qualify for the final. But um, mm. shout out to Michael and yep. his uh, Disney knowledge. Yes, and subscribe to him on YouTube at Disney Enchanted. Oh, there you go. <laughs> and that is tricky. Yeah. Because when you type in Disney, Disney Enchanted, Enchanted, it comes with the film. Because <laughs> when he applied to be on the show, and we do have a bit yeah. of a system where we have to mm. promote, obviously, um, make verify that they are. Yeah, who they say they are. Who they say they are. Yeah. And when I typed in Disney Enchanted, it came out with the film, yeah? Yeah. It came out <laughs> with the film, the review, This is I 2. It was very difficult. Yeah, and then you have to click on. Like filters, channels, and then these comes up on YouTube. Yeah, so that's what you're going to have to do. Go to the channel selection. And then under filters on the side of YouTube and click channels and then you find him. And then you'll get to him. But um, yeah. that's a little <laughs> plug for Michael. Hopefully yeah. he's listening. Hope he is. And um, yeah, so but mm. there is also, I said there's messages where people have yeah. revoked their Team Luke. Yep, but there, just are, seems to it. there are some messages. Ooh. That are keeping you um, in their hearts and in their prayers. Okay. And Is that half of Team Luke still there? They're still, that. yeah, they're still with you, but they're kind of falling off the edge. Yeah, they're holding on. They're gripping onto that. <laughs> yes. And they've nearly fallen off of uh... into Team Stewart's area. Yeah. But look, <laughs> um, like I said, I didn't mm-hmm. want to dwell too much on this because no. you can go back, you can listen, you can mm. watch on YouTube. Yeah, you can listen on Spotify, watch on YouTube. And I don't think it's fair to go over Luke's losses. He's no. had two losses in a row now. Yeah, so far. Um, <laughs> Summer Games, obviously a big one where you lost yeah. all the gold, all the and championships. And then the Halloween Games is, I lost that. That was supposed to be... My uh, comeback. Yeah, that was supposed to be... <laughs> <laughs> some justice, um, but a chance for revenge. It never happened. And unfortunately, but as you can see, if yep. you watch the video, you can see the state of Luke. He is yeah. not. I got you, murdered. <laughs> you was not 100%. No, I had an oven made. <laughs> you did. It looked very, um, yeah. very, very violent. <laughs> and um, But fortunately, <laughs> you seem to have healed up quite well. <laughs> quite well. And Yeah, like, um, like that kind of thing. <laughs> And I think the only mm. last thing that I will say... About the Halloween games. About the Halloween games, about your... Mm. Um, Not, uh, knowledge, or what? I don't know what you're going to say. Your <laughs> losses, your yeah. two losses in the row. Mm. Yeah. Now, obviously, it's November 4th, yes. and um, tomorrow we've got the fireworks, we've got oh, yeah. all the good uh, bonfire mm. activities. Um, but then, looking mm. forward beyond that, and I don't want to <laughs> hype oh, it or I plug know. it or say anything too much about it because we are still... In the planning stages on the Mayhem production. Well, we're a ways away as well, so I don't want to yeah. uh, insert... Um, anything. ...these words into people's ear holes if I don't have no. to. But it's... to give people a glimmer of hope... Yeah. There is another... I'm gonna hit. Shall we hint it a little bit or not? I think we should, I think we should just okay. give that little, little bit it, of hope. It goes like this. It goes... The next games are... Oh, I thought you were going to do oh. like a... Yeah, when I When you said hint... I am, I'm doing a hint, but I'm going to say... It. I thought you were going to do like a hymn or something to kind of get... A, and then Ooh. a clue. I'm going to do this clue, ready? Hoo, hoo, hoo! Does that give a hint? It kind of does. 
But I don't <laughs> do that one more time for us. Ho ho ho! There we go. Because at first you went, <laughs> we sound like you had something yeah. in the chest, but it is traditionally ho ho ho. 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 And what does that mean? <laughs> that can only mean one thing. thing in the planning of the Monday Mayhem. And we have seen um, mm. myself and Luke compete before in yes. games this uh, mm. particular time of year, and that would be the. Christmas games. The Christmas games. So they are around the corner. Yes. Um, obviously, we've still got um, some time to go, mm. but that is where on you, its way. That's where you can have that in the distance, mm. the light at the end of the tunnel. Yes. Will I get my championship back? Luke's uh, final chance mm. in 2024 at least. Yeah. Or it might be 2025 before I get it back. Who knows? Well, look, no, that. Come on. <laughs> Let's let's keep our <laughs> let's hopes keep forward for the Christmas games to see if I win it. Dreams set mm. on the Christmas games, but once yes. we have some updates about that, we will update you on the show. We will be plugging and promoting that, but for yes, tonight's at the show, moment, we're not. For tonight's show, yes, we are going to carry forward and carry on because we have a few topics to discuss. Yeah. Yep. Um, what's your favourite colour? Oh, my favourite colour is red. And this is not a chat line, but your favourite colour is... Red. <laughs> red, the colour of blood. Well, yes. <laughs> we're close to red. We okay. are the colour of... Uh, colour the world, orange day. Okay, the colour of pumpkins. <laughs> that's true, actually. Yeah, but that's... Hey, that's another... hey let's not get back into that when goes. <laughs> yeah, that's... Uh... <laughs> They should all be um, composted by now. <laughs> yes. They should be in people's uh, yeah. green bins or yeah, and all that. wherever the council mm. asks you to uh, put them. Put them. Or, no, I suppose once you carve a pumpkin, you can't really yeah, cook it, can you? can't cook it off that, can it's you? Because the insides would have gone and... Yeah. Okay, yeah. all right, forget that. Okay, it. forget that bit. Don't want to poison anyone. Okay, <laughs> but what we are looking at today, because mm. obviously we have a bonfire night tomorrow. Yes. So um, we could have spoken about that, but we are going to mm. speak about Colour the world orange yes. day. What does that mean to you, Luke? It, it means like you're painting colours all over the, the past. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> okay, well, that would be vandalism. So yes, that's, I know I said that. That's not what it's about. <laughs> but it is a, a meaningful event. It is a day to raise awareness about okay. complex regional pain syndrome, oh. CRPS, a chronic pain condition that is mm. often misunderstood. Now, uh, I think we hear more and more about this uh, these days. Yeah. Chronic pain. Yeah, we hear that more often than not. Yeah, so it seems like, um, fortunately, it's mm. getting more out into the world and people yeah. are starting to get some understanding on it. But, yes. Uh, it is something that does mm. um, cause a lot of suffering for a lot mm. of people. And this apparently is... I've never heard about this before. Mm -hmm. And obviously, it's quite late in the day, so yeah. there's not much we can do about it. <laughs> no. But I think it's interesting just to um, mm. see that there is a day mm -hmm. which um, tries to educate people about the conditions and the challenges that patients suffer. So, okay, um, does that make you forget about losing? Yeah, it does. Twice in a row. Yeah, it doesn't make me <laughs> think about something else instead of the losing. We just brought up on now memory. <laughs> so there you go. So there is something. So maybe mm. someone didn't know about that. I didn't know about yeah. it. But um, really that's trying to just mm. make Luke forget. But obviously the colour yes. orange you associate so straight away, away to pumpkins. To pumpkins. So that didn't help, did it? Okay. It didn't, did it? All right. Well, that's a big shame because I thought that was yeah. going to be like something to um forget the uh, james <laughs> forget about it um but all right um let's mm. scrap that then let's not remember that again <laughs> yeah let's not carry on with that um but mm. i will say we have and this is just an early okay. indication here of the interest uh-huh there has been one or two messages into the studio who are looking forward to the Christmas games? The Christmas games. Oh, come on. Um, and there's been double that amount who have told us not to say anything about Christmas until December. Yeah. Mm. Um, but can I just say, oh God. there are some Christmas stuff in shops already. <laughs> yeah, I think that's what they were getting to. I think they were kind of, <laughs> they've kind of had... Yeah, they've seen it too much in shops and thought, don't say it till December. <laughs> and it does, and I will stand by it. I do think yeah. it does kind of 
mm. ruin the uniqueness. Yeah. It kind of blurs the line, doesn't it? Yeah, it goes from Halloween straight, straight into, into it. it. Yeah. yeah. But well, before even Halloween... I mean, Halloween stuff comes out anyway in like, September time. Yeah. And then you see the Christmas stuff already appearing. In October. Um, yeah, so it kind of <laughs> blurs the lines for people, yeah. which I don't like. It's like I like clear, <laughs> defined lines. Yeah, there's of seasonal Halloween celebrations. End done, December, Christmas. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what I like. So we will try not mm. to say anything else about yeah. um, the c word. Yes, we won't say the word. Ho, and ho, that's ho. not the word that you're thinking of. Ho ho ho! We won't say anything about that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> There'll be no more Christmas. Oh! oh! Okay, he said the word. This is Monday Night Mayhem. Yes, it is. And we would like to apologise because mm. apparently that last bit before the um, Justin Timberlake song yeah. was a little bit... Uh, Staticky. Yeah, a bit fuzzy there. Yeah. And I can tell you right mm. now, it is very late on Monday yes. night. So our producers mm. are tired. And, and we're getting tired. <laughs> we are getting tired. <laughs> and anyone who can fix that... Mm. Um, Please do. Wasn't here at the time. Uh, yeah. But it seems to have cleared up. Yeah, it's cleared up now. I hope it wasn't anything to the left over from Halloween. Look, if you, I, we said we were not going to mention <laughs> Damn the C word <laughs> or... The H word. Or the H word, yeah. <laughs> and I just said it. <laughs> <laughs> but you're right, it could have been a leftover over thing from Halloween. And no, you just said the word. You didn't have to say it. H. Yeah, there you go. H from Steps. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but look, I've got mm. a few more things yeah. to um, bring up mm-hmm. uh, to try and put everything what we... We're talking about at the beginning of the show were... out the window. Yeah, that we cannot talk about any longer. Give with H. Exactly. So uh, Not H from Steps. But definitely not H from Steps, <laughs> although he's a lovely person. Yes. Um, I haven't got anything pulled up ready <laughs> to say about to him. To talk about him, but I'm sure the producers will work and tirelessly. It's, it's nothing to do with Halloween. <laughs> Come on, you, you're torturing yourself now. I know. Luke. Yes. If I was to say to you, Venice. Mm hmm. Venice? No, that's the place. Okay, sorry. If I Venice? Was, yeah, Venice is a very lovely place. <laughs> People complain that it smells, but when I went there... It doesn't. It wasn't too bad, you know, like okay. uh, the beauty of the... Uh, but anyway, I wasn't... Anyway, not that. I was not trying to talk about <laughs> Venice, even though it's absolutely lovely. Yeah. And you only need probably two days there, really. Yeah. Um, any longer is a bit of an excess. But anyway. Um, <laughs> <laughs> absolutely lovely, though. Right. But you, you, anyway, what, what are you going to talk about? <laughs> you will get wet. Okay. Right. Um, if it rains, anyway. Yeah. Or uh, you go in order. No. Oh, no, it's not raining. It's a raisin tide. Raisin hey. tide, isn't it? Okay. Well, what I was trying to say... Is I'm so sorry, I'm getting distracted. There are pictures of H from Steps on the computer. Yes. Um, and I'm glad that they've brought that up, but that's not actually what... That wasn't a serious thing that I said last time. Um, okay, here we go. Luke. Yes. What would you say if I said venison? I don't know what... I don't um, know what I would say. I'll think of, think of the place. <laughs> Not that again. But no, I'll think of food. I'll think of food. And you wouldn't think of Venice? No. Good. Okay, what if I said pheasant? A bird. Ah, okay, partridge? In the pear tree. Oh, hey, don't say the C word. <laughs> no, they didn't. We all know a that. A bird again, I'll say bird. I we all know that, that Carol. Okay, uh, what about a wood pigeon? A bird? <laughs> I went there, there, because I was thinking. <laughs> and what about hare? A rabbit. Oh, good. Uh, wild boar? Oh, wild boar. Uh, jungle. Oh, interesting. Um, duck? <laughs> crackers. No, don't actually do the duck. I... Crackers. Crackers. Oh, crackers, nice. <laughs> <laughs> crackers, I like it. Uh, rabbit? Hopping along. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Well, look, if you haven't... I, Luke hasn't put the clues together. No, I haven't. And that's why we need to do a little bit more training before the end of... You know, the, uh, yes, that, uh, games. the next <laughs> games on the horizon, <laughs> uh, the C word games, but, <laughs> but all of those are game, yeah. No, I don't know what you're saying. Well, I just went, Look, yep. I'm trying, I'm doing my best right now to try and find <laughs> topics of conversation to try and get you away from dwelling on your um losses. I didn't want to say it. But I did. Okay, because this week, Mm -hmm. not last week, not next week, this very week is Great British Game Week. 
Okay. Okay. Now, I don't know how you're going to celebrate that, mm. Luke. Maybe um, you're going to go pick up a bit of roadkill from the side of the road. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> um, but mm. if you can, it is a week to celebrate all uh, those meats that are available, but you do have to go a little bit more hunting um, to go get them because they... And get in from the butchers. Yeah, maybe some reputable butchers <laughs> would have those available. Yes. <laughs> um, but you don't really see much of those kind of meats mm. at the supermarket. No. Um, but they are supposedly um, a lot healthier for you. Okay. Uh, because they have less um, fat. Yeah. Um, they're supposed to be better mm. for the environment because they're locally okay. sourced. So there is a lot of upside to yes. um, Great British Game. Mm. But going through that list again, um, uh-huh. I don't think personally I've had yeah. duck, uh-huh. but I don't think I've had anything else off that list, actually. Well, I haven't had a rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> Hopping along. Yeah. <laughs> In my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. Pigeon? Mm. Never had that. No, partridge, no. Pheasant. Partridge in a pear tree. Right. <laughs> we keep that out of our mouths. Of our mouths for this. <laughs> um, so basically, that was just to try mm. and... Um, Forget about. Yeah. So I have that, forgotten about it now. I, well, hey, it's working. It doesn't quite sound like you have. Um, <laughs> I lost something. Would I lose? <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, so that's just um, mm. that's really a, yeah. a lot of nothing. But um, if you can go out and get some British game this week, if you if you can, you can. You know, if you can't, you do the can can. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. There's lots of things that you can do on uh, Great British Game Week. <laughs> I don't think it would have the same meaning of uh, no. It'd be something different. <laughs> but you, it, look, anyone is free to do the can can. Yeah. At nearly any point of time, are they? Yeah, I think it's free to do any time of year. So, <laughs> Halloween. Oh, so oh. Halloween. <laughs> but look, think about it. How you can can. You, you can, can. You can do the can can if you can do the can. If you can, and you can not. <laughs> well, you can do it in a bank. Yeah. I don't think they'll stop you. They might look they're at you a bit. So they might think, what are you doing here? <laughs> yeah, as long Can't as you... do it in a police station, I don't know. They might find you weird. Um, police station, yeah. Poss- well, I t- well, if you've got handcuffs on, you'll still be able to do the can-can. Yeah, you can just need your legs. You just need your legs. So unless they chain up your legs, you're free to do <laughs> yes. the can-can yeah. in a police station. <laughs> yeah. All you um, need is the music. <laughs> yeah, crossing the street, you can do the can-can. Yeah. I can't think of anywhere that you can't do the can-can. Mm. But yeah, we're going on to a different topic now. Mm. <laughs> Listeners, if you know... <laughs> anywhere you cannot do the can-can... Yes. Just mess us in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is an interesting... That's probably more mm. interesting than Great British Game Week. Yeah. Is uh, where can you not do... Do the can-can if you can't do the can-can in that place. Yeah. Yeah, that's... don't start your message with that. That'd be too much to type. <laughs> um, maybe, well, quicksand is obvious. Yeah, you'll go all the way down. Yeah, because that would probably increase the speed of which you're sinking, sinking into the quicksand. <laughs> um, Can you do it on top of that Eiffel Tower? Yeah, probably. Yeah, I think they would appreciate it there. Yeah, because it's the home of like Moulin Rouge and those kind of yeah stuff. Yeah, performances. Mm. Hmm, very curious. You yes. brought up a great question. I think even the great Stuart Torn wouldn't be able to answer. answer that one. <laughs> Maybe that should have been on the quiz. Should have been. Where can you not do the can can? But <laughs> nobody would see who got it why. <laughs> exactly, right. Well, that is mm. um Yes. Some topics of discussion that I've mm. tried to wash away the um the remnants of our last show. Show, but um did it work at all? Don't know. You're not too sure? Well, what about this? Let's go to... Mountains. Oh. Oh. What? <laughs> I Look, I've left... Luke, um, yep. we uttered the words, I believe you uttered yeah. the words, probably. I'm not too sure. We'll have to go back on the mm. tape. Uh, maybe Spy Report picked up. He's always... Listening in. That's it, the eye in the sky. Yep. Um, but because... Mm-hmm. Someone in the studio mentioned yes the great the all powerful H yes from Steps we have mm. had quite a few messages coming in coming in uh, with a lot of um, Steps love okay a lot of love for Steps mm. um, and so I thought mm-hmm. um, like you said an upbeat 
upbeat show. You said you asked for an upbeat show. <laughs> and I believe mm-hmm. a Steps quiz to end this show is quite an upbeat. Yeah, it is, because they're upbeat songs, aren't they, by Steps? They are actually classics now. I don't know if the, one of their songs is called Five, Six, Seven, Eight. Da, 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 da. I don't know if that's their song or not. <laughs> What's that? Um, <laughs> are you? I've just told you that we've had some die-hard fans. I'm trying not to in. ruin them. Are you trying to offend them before we've even started the quiz? No. <laughs> okay. Um, but it's true. They did have the um, a song like that. Yeah, the five, six, seven, eight. The boot scooting baby is driving me crazy. Fire me, baby. Yeah, that one. Yeah, that's one of my favourite songs. Well, I was them. trying to delineate from the lyrics the title of the song by singing it to myself and then you came in with false lyrics to confuse <laughs> that's me. one of my favorite songs anyway by steps anyway i'm glad that you showed um your knowledge of steps <laughs> good god that's anyway let's see how well i do here let's see right okay well we're all doing this together yeah this we're doing this fun... together in here it's not like the old games exactly this is just a fun little quiz yeah because we've had a, uh, a few messages um, mm. that have... Coming in saying, upbeat it a bit more. Yeah, they're fans them. of the steps, and we yeah. did say it, so let's... Um, let's get this going. Let's go with it. So, in the last thing on my mind video, one of the members was wearing the same outfit that he or she wore to the initial audition. Which member was Ooh, it? Is it H? Lee, Claire, or Faye? I'm going to go for H, I'm not sure. What do you think? I'm going to say that it's going to be... It's going to be me. That's Britney Spears. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, no. It's going to be me. <laughs> From the same era, but not the right answer. Okay. Mm. So, um, I'm going to say they wore the same outfit. Yeah. Now, who would be more inclined to wear the same outfit? For me, it's Alv Lee or H. Yeah. You. Okay, well, let's go... H. Let's go H, because we started yeah, we with was, H. We started saying H. He's the one who instigated there this. Is quiz out there. Okay, now, <laughs> Faye's birthday is on which date? Is, is it, it the... 18th of October. That's my brother's birthday. Oh, yeah? Uh, is it the 5th of September? The 14th of November. Or the 9th of December. Oh, close to your birthday. Yeah, the day after my birthday. So oh, close. So close. Okay, so... Okay, I'm guessing... What do you think? Um, I was going well, to go... I was I'm... going in the middle, too. Oh, okay. Well, I was <laughs> wanting to uh, go with the 18th of October, because yeah. it's my brother's birthday. Yeah. Um, but I will let you... I, I was going final... out... I was going to go, like, 5th of September or the 14th of November. They both sound good. 14th. I okay. I'm going to say. But it is... If it is the top one, that'll be now, the 18th. That'll be weird. <laughs> what was Step's first number one oh. hit? Was it... One for the sorrow. Chain reaction. Tragedy. Or the song that you mentioned earlier. Five, five six, six, seven, eight. eight. Oh, I can't remember. What was their first and one hit? It's got to be... It's got to be one, five, six, seven, eight, isn't it? I'm going to... Yeah, it's got to be... So catchy, isn't it? So catchy. Yeah, you wouldn't do your first number one oh, as a sad song. No. Nothing but a chain reaction. Action. And then tragedy. The that was a big one. Da, 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 that's tragedy. Probably, that's probably yeah. their biggest one. Yeah. But I don't think that was their first one. No, I think it's five, six, seven, eight. Let's do it. Let's go for that one. Okay, we're locked in the answer. Now, what was the name of Lisa's partner <laughs> when she competed on Dancing on Ice? Was it Daniel Wils- uh, Watson? <laughs> was it Matt Evers? Fred Patrick? Or Andre Lipinova? Oh, I'm going to... What do you think first? Because um, I have not a clue. I, don't I haven't watch... watched Dancing on Ice no. either. I don't know if you have. No, I'm afraid. So it, I'm going to real... go Matt Evan, Matt one. Yeah, let's go Matt. That sounds more... Now, what step song was released in 1999 and featured during the Gold Tour? It went to number two on the UK single chart. Okay, is it Deeper, Shade of Blue? Love's Got a Hold of My Heart. One for the Sorrow. Or Tragedy. Or oh, those two again. <laughs> Uh, uh, I don't think tragedy was earlier. Yeah, I don't think it was tragedy. Um, it we're could going nineteen ninety nine here. It could be one for the sorrow. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Like, because it's, it's like a sad song. Yeah, and it's like it was on the. I don't know. What yeah, do you I think? mean, you know, I think that's a good. Mm. That's a good. Um, yes. Pick there. Okay, now Lisa mm. and Johnny Shetnall Ooh. performed. In a production of Jack and the Beanstalk in 2008, what was the name of Lisa's character? Was it Princess Alison? Princess Amber. 
Princess I- I- Amy. <laughs> or Princess Amelia. Oh, I was going to go for Amy. I was going to go for Amber. Think? Yeah? Ooh. I'll go for Amber if you want. Let's go Amber. Okay, well, look, we've still got some time left yes. to finish off the quiz. We've got a few more questions. Yes, we have. But let's get to the next one, which is Steps. In celebration of... Well, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Put, let's change up. I know we've got okay, that yes. was Steps. And let's get to the answers because we haven't yeah. got time to do the rest of the questions. No. But you never know. In the future, we might do a whole Steps show. It might so, happen. Uh, let's do the f- the same outfit. Who yes. wore the same outfit in the audition as in the music video? I went for H. Yeah, we both went for H, and it was Claire. Uh. Now, Faye Toya's birthday is on which date? You said? The 14th of November. And that is correct. Oh, yes. Cool, a big Faye fan. Oh, I didn't know. I was just guessing. <laughs> <laughs> now, what was Step's first number one here? It wasn't the song we played just uh, five, six, seven, eight. It was? It was a tragedy. Uh, An absolute tragedy. You lost twice yes. in a row. You lost all the <laughs> yes. championships. All right, all right. Monday Night right. Mayhem has, now has no gold. The gold okay. is now allocated to someone else. Yes, Outside. we get it. We get it. Sorry. We get it. Okay, sorry, let's get back to the answers. Okay. <laughs> now, what was the name of Lisa's partner when she complete, uh, competed on Dancing on Ice? It was Matt Evans. There you go. You got that right. Congratulations. Now, what was the song first released in 1999? For the Golden Tour. We said One for Sorrow, but it was actually... Lovers Got Hold of My Heart. Ah. Oh, look, here we go. And Lisa, oh, yeah. when she performed in Jack of the Beanstalk, we went Princess Amber. It was actually... The Princess Amelia. Your choice. What are you trying to do me like that? <laughs> I don't know. What are you trying to... <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, um, look, uh, what did H... Oh... We didn't answer that one. We, no, that's as far as we got. Okay, yeah. well, there we go. So there's That's a, all the quiz we had time for there. That's all the quiz we had time for. Yeah. But look, if there is a mm. lot of Steps fans out there, I'm sure we Please can do... Please message in for next time and we'll do a Step full show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll step into it. Yeah, Steps of Mayhem. Five, six... Yes. Five, six, seven, eight, mayhem. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know what to call it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, right. Well, look, mm. we have had a lot of fun... Well, I hope so. You asked for an upbeat show. That's what we're trying to provide here. I don't know. Yeah, we had loads of mayhem on this show, like talk about the old Halloween show yes. and the Christmas show. Yes, we've got something planned. So yeah, keep listening, keep subscribed mm. because, like we yeah. said, um, there's a lot of videos on there. Oh, coming out. Uh, yeah. So uh, keep watching, and yeah. also as well, make sure you're signed up to the Spotify. Oh yes, follow us on Spotify for updates of this show or just new shows. New shows and. Is there anything else to say? Are we, have I we think, healed all the wounds? I think we have, and I'm obsessed with the next game.